Hello children. In the previous video, we learned to read time from the watch. In this video, we will learn more about it by some interesting examples. Finally, it's 12 o'clock and Chanda puts on her shoes. Children, can you tell what the needles of the clock look like at uh, 12 o'clock? That's correct. The hour needle is exactly on number 12. And minute needle is also on number 12. As soon as Chanda put on her magic shoes, she reached such a place. Chanda can't believe her eyes. She has reached in such a world where there are only walnuts around her. Once again, the angel came there. She told Chanda that she can collect as many walnuts as she can and take with her till 2 o'clock. Chanda found a basket there and started collecting walnuts in it. Now Chanda saw the time in her watch. The needles were like this. Children, can you tell what time it is now in Chanda's watch? If you want, you can stop the video and find the answer. Well done, children. You have found the right answer. In Chanda's watch, the hour needle is between 1 and 2. So, it's 1 hour. And the minute needle is on number 4. So, how many minutes does that make? Yes, 4 times 5 or 20 minutes. In this way, the time in Chanda's watch is still 1 hour 20 minutes. Chanda was so happy that she forgot about the time. Now, when she saw the time in the clock, it was 50 minutes past 1. Children, can you tell us what the needles of the clock will look like at 1 hour 50 minutes? Because a few minutes have passed since 1, the hour needle will be between numbers 1 and 2. And at what number will the minute needle be to show 50 minutes? This is very easy. As we multiply the number on clock by 5, to find the time in minutes, to find out what number the needle points to, we have to reverse it. That is, minutes divided by 5. So, 50 is divided by 5. How many does that make? Exactly! 10. Therefore, the minute needle will be on the number 10. In this way, we can show 1 hour 50 minutes. Shanda is still busy collecting walnuts. The watch showed 2 o'clock, but Chanda did not even know. Chanda started collecting walnuts more rapidly. In her hurry, one of her shoes was left there. And Chanda came back to her house by magic. Chanda is sad. 
that her shoe was lost and that the watch also disappeared. But Chanda was very happy to see her walnut basket and gladly started eating the walnuts. Now, what will happen to that magic watch? We will see in the next video. Children, in this video, we learned more about reading time in the watch through some interesting examples. In the next video, we will see some common mistakes related to it.